Good morning, Phono friends. Don Wilson here with a, another exciting episode of As the Record Turns. Uh, this time, what I have for you is a, a new product, my first ever 12 inch record, and that is uh, Gas Shell Bombardment. Uh, as we all know, the um, uh, famous, infamous uh, World War I recording, um, the only recording made on the battlefront during World War I, uh, the only audio recording that is, um, that there's been a tremendous speculation as to its authenticity, and I think recently it was discovered um, that while most of it is authentic, uh, World War I battleground um, uh, recording done by none other than Fred Geisberg, that uh, it was then later later um, dubbed and uh, additional sound effects put on top of it before commercial release. Uh, there were some technical issues with making this disc. This is the first 12 inch shellac compatible disc that I've made. And um, w when I initially set up um, my um, copying lab, the uh, I set up all the equipment so that I would be able to copy 12 inch records, uh, making sure that all the uh, containers were suitably sized, etc. But there's a difference between specking things for that size and actually doing it. Um, so tremendously difficult. Uh, making a, a mold for a 12-inch record, the mold ended up being close to 14 inches in diameter and it didn't fit in anything. Oh god. So um, it took a while. But um, this is copy number one. See, there's me. And... Um, See if we can get some detail on the label. This is a uh, very clean e-condition, uh, very early uh, pressing of it. Uh, there were later pressings that had uh, slightly different labels and different logos on the back. Uh, but this is a very early one and I'm very excited to um, now be able to um, play copy number one for you to hear. Now, of course, the irony of this recording is that um, the use of chemical weapons is something that we generally associate with the Germans, 
on the Allies, and I guess that's because the victors write the history books. And it is ironic that the only audio recording from World War I is exactly um, a counter to much of what we're generally taught, that here's the British uh, using chemical weapons to shell the Germans. Uh, so just a remarkable piece of history that's uh, captured for all to hear. And um, uh, I hope that you've enjoyed hearing it, uh, perhaps even the uh, explanation of some of the technical challenges in reproducing this disc. And um, uh, thanks for watching. Any questions, comments, you know, you can always comment below or uh, send me an email, donandphilly at gmail.com. Thanks for watching.